developing tonight. It's hard to see in the dark. The same is true for drivers, but this is video of a man caught driving his golf cart going the wrong way on the freeway. DPS trooper spotting the 83 year old on the loop 202 near McQueen and this is not the first time. That's right, Stephanie. Just last month, he was spotted on the I-10 near Wild Horse Pass driving his golf cart as others zoomed by. Troopers say the man was confused, but OK. Well, he's now home with his wife, and while nobody was hurt this time, the danger is real. ABC 15's Justin Bezerra is live along the 202 for us tonight, talking with one driver who actually witnessed all of this and calling it a near miss. Uh, it was a near miss for this guy, Katie. Uh, the driver of that golf cart finally stopped here along the 202 at Arizona Avenue. When he got off, DPS says that they actually had to box him in because he was refusing to stop. Now, this witness, he owns his own landscaping company. He was out running errands this morning, and he says he saw that golf cart headed right towards him. Uh, the Cape Lombagos haven't done well in the heat this summer, but uh, they should come back here in the wintertime. And Chris Finnessy owns his own landscaping company. His job starts pretty early, sometimes 3 o'clock in the morning. This morning, he was picking up supplies when he noticed small headlights headed right towards him. They weren't marking the road. They weren't doing anything like that that morning, so it was really unusual to have somebody right there coming on the interstate coming down that way with lights. Chris couldn't figure out what was going on. I slowed down about 20 miles an hour and I'm like, it, th that's a golf cart. Behind the wheel, an 83 year old man. DPS says the driver got on the freeway at McQueen and managed to make it a mile to Arizona Avenue where he got off. Drivers calling 911 reporting a golf cart headed the wrong way. Hey, 911, what's your emergency? Hey, there's a guy literally in a golf cart going the wrong way on the 202 and they're like a golf cart. This is the second time in about a month DPS has stopped the same man for getting on a valley freeway going the wrong way in a golf cart. Last month he was stopped on I-10 near Wild Horse Pass. DPS says the man has a mental illness associated with age. Both times he was released to his family. Chris is just happy he and other drivers were able to see the golf cart in time. So I did talk with DPS this afternoon and they said that a trooper did make contact with this man's wife. Now, as for that golf cart, they said a family member did come and pick up that golf cart. So hopefully this will not happen a third time. We're live in the Far East Valley. Justin Pizarro, ABC 15, Arizona. We certainly hope so, Justin. Thank you.